Okay, this is uh, one of the only remaining uh, air fans from the early 1900s in existence in this old coal mine. And uh, the shaft goes straight down into the flooded remains of the coal mine. And this was uh, early 1900s, best guess around 1910 to this mine. And they had a motor mount right here that actually turned this uh, huge flywheel that turned the fan. And the fan went count, uh, clockwise, bringing the air from the uh, air induction and actually just uh, turned the fan and it shot the fresh air down into the coal mine. And this is uh, very rare to even see one of these because they just don't exist anymore. So you can see we're out here in the middle of nowhere uh, to... Uh, find this and investigate this so it's pretty historic they, these just don't exist anymore it's too bad there's a lot of sunlight but uh, these are the fan blades and it just turned an enormous amount of air. Into the coal mine. Keep it ventilated. And that's actually the air shaft that goes straight down into the coal mine that's flooded. So, pretty historic. And uh, also, it's don't want to get too near that shaft slip in there because if you go down in there you're not coming back out so who knows how deep that coal mine is but anyway just thought I'd video this because it's very historic you just don't see these anymore when they uh, ceased operations in coal mines and tore everything down sealed up the mines they, they dismantled all this stuff and sealed up these shafts so but uh, just thought uh, we'd document this to show how historic it is. shaft right here goes down about a good hundred plus feet before you hit the flooded remains of the coal mine and this is uh, it's pretty, pretty pretty steep straight down shot this is what the miners had to make uh, for the construction of this air shaft it's hard to say how far down the actual mine workings were since it's flooded but like I said that's a good hundred 125 feet to the water and it's no telling, you know, how much the water is up over the actual mine workings. But uh, anyway, that's uh, pretty dangerous. So we don't want to give the location out of uh, where this mine is in the woods just for this reason. But uh, we just wanted to come see it. So anyway, uh, that's it. Here's 
the actual fan to the air shaft right here. That you can see. But it just stuck out of here in the middle of nowhere, deep in the woods. Did uh, this was uh, first constructed 1908, 1910. Stayed in operation for about 25 years. Still intact. And you can see the uh, spindle right there, which they had a power plant right here at Big Motor. And it's probably uh, at first steam driven, you know, steam to supply electricity, and then later in years it was converted to all electric. But this is the main spindle, which uh, the power plant was right here to uh, turn this giant fan. So all right pretty historic and that right there is the the drop into hell <laughs> literally literally the drop into hell man <laughs> so okay well that was great to finally come out here and see this so you can see we are deep in the woods there is no one anywhere for a long way around